It's Kerbal time. Perth or bust? Die, Perth. Die. Okay. This time, so I think we've got, we've pretty much got it dialed in. Now we can figure out, like, yeah, I know you did some reading about the electrical systems. We can either try to do some electrical work yes. to get some sort of stabilization going, here's, or I can try to finesse the controls to hit Perth. <laughs> here's my reading on the subject is okay. that uh, the electrical system should have worked. Oh, Apparently wow. strapping a... Now, here's the thing. That message might say that because you only generate electricity with those particular systems while the engine is running. So what I suggest we do is maybe strap the fuel cells and slap some batteries on. So that way the the charge from the engines will charge up the battery. And when inevitably we run out of rocket fuel, we can still have power. Okay, we can try that. So yeah, the uh, fuel so cell. So we need the fuel cell. Yep. A little one. Uh, you anywhere put, on put, the tank? Yeah, but put that in um, radial mode or balanced mode. Oh, you know what we actually need first is we need some stabilization ring. And uh, get, How yeah, do we do that? I don't know. Command and control. Hey, I want to do something other. I want to get a cone because it's really bugging the shit out of me that we don't have a proper rocket. Can you put a... You want me to try and strap the cone to... To well, the no, stabilizer? No, what I want you to do is like set there should be an empty shell of a rocket in in the structural facility. So so put that stuff on, that's fine. Um and then put that on and then there should be like an empty hull segment. Empty hull segment. It's a structural piece. Like it, it's it's kind of like a fuel tank except for it's just empty. Yeah, uh, there fuselage? you go. Yeah, throw that thing on there. Ah, oh, shit. Between the no, well, it needs to be. It needs to go over the entire assembly, so you can put a. Because I think that the cone will not go over there for some reason. Like that, right? <laughs> sure, let's make a cone out of that shit. I thought there was a bigger one. Like, how can we fully enclose the Sputnik shit? Like, if we want to launch that as a proper satellite. Tricoupler. Uh, I'm not seeing anything bigger than that. Oh, go down to the air. There's uh, aerodynamic ones, aren't they? Like the fins. Yeah, there we oh, go. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, strap. That's a too small, I think. Uh, it's... Well, I mean, it's too small for the rocket. What the fuck is this? Get it out of there. Get one of the fat ones. Okay, I can't delete that now. Whoa. That's too big. <laughs> Well, maybe not. That was like in front of the camera. There we go. That's pretty good. There's yeah. the Goldilocks. Just throw it on top All of the right. rocket. So let's strap the coupler. To, let's strap the okay. stabilizer to it. This is terrible. I don't, yeah, let's see what happens if you put it on. <laughs> go put it on the launch pad and see if it renders the cone. Because if it doesn't, I'm going to be so fucking pissed. Okay. Let's save this thing first. Save. Now, launch. Whoa. It says no remote control controlled or man. Why? When did this start happening? We took the pot off. We took that. Uh, really, is Sputnik has been allowing Sputnik. Uh, uh, the Sputnik. this. The Sputnik's been what's allowing us to control the thing this whole time. Crew safety. All eight weight yep. spear equipped to the remote and receivers and relay. Oh, you're right. You're right. That's what's been allowing it to. All it right. Well, it's I, I electricity, still... so we must have had electricity. Well, right? the engine does generate electricity. Okay, so why wouldn't our why couldn't we just I, use the stabilizer in line with? I this? don't know. Uh, throw that on. The, just throw it on the. I just want to see it on launch pad and see if the fucking cone. There. Renders. How about that? It's not going to render though because we've done this before. Now nah, we got it. This is good. This will work. If it does, then great. <laughs> It'll at least look cooler. No, see, this is for shit. Here we no. go. <laughs> All right. Well, let's 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 show off your control a little bit now. Okay. Does it seem like you got more control? No. <laughs> but it might be more stable. Like the stabilizer just keeps things keeps things going the way they should. Uh let's zoom in here and see. All right. Can you pause it? There's no way to pause it. Is, is this showing my current trajectory? Yes. Okay, so we need to get that around to Perth, yeah. which is. Yeah, we want to here. hit that. Yep. Okay. So, so you need a little bit more oomph. You come a little more this way. Or okay. Let, so let's see what the trajectory is now. A little bit more. Let me up my throttle a little bit. Yeah. Oh shit! What's the, what the fuck is happening? Oh, it's now? stabilizing us to go straight up. I 
don't know that that's true. Well, no, it's sending us it's sending us straight down now. <laughs> Can you control that? Can you bring it back around? Uh, Are you trying potentially, to? Potentially, yeah, but... Cut the engine, for Christ's sake. No, here we go. All Got right. it. Got it. What? Uh, uh, okay, how do I cut the engine? Oh, shit. Throttle down. Okay. Now, the nice thing about the... You should be able to control it without it. I mean, I thought that's the whole thing about the um, gyroscope stable is you can actually still move it around with the dead engine. I guess so. Okay, let's yeah. pull it back this way. I think we'll be... Like, I'm going to fire some, some engines there here. There you go. Oh, Jesus shit. Jesus Christ. These fucking sticky We need to keys. disable that. Yeah, well... <laughs> That's truth. Uh, let's let's what? slam the gas here. <laughs> this is not working, man. I know. This is uh. I know. It is difficult to control this ship. Don't I know it, sir? Don't I know it? Actually, I don't okay. know it. I'm just over here being critical. Jesus Christ! Can't man can't fly a rocket. <laughs> what are you doing? Up. He's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna land it. No, nope, I think, nope, that, I nope. think, <laughs> I do believe the engine has to be running at that portion of throttle to supply electricity to the um, stabilizer. Although I think it's trying to stabilize me in some weird way. Uh, all right. Well, let's abort this and then go back and read what the actual module does. <laughs> go, go, God damn it! It seemed like it was working so well. Yeah, it's not working at all. There's no way I'm going to hit that. Okay, uh, well... Okay, abort mission. Yeah. Mission abort. How the fuck do I abort this mission? Uh, I wonder... It says... All right, motherfuckers, we're blasting Oh, off. I see. Abort doesn't oh. actually do anything by itself. This will abort it real fast. You have to have a you have to have an abort like Gosh. you know you have to have like a parachute and eject stage for it to do something. I'm out of gas, and I'm crashing toward the earth. Yeah, see, this thing is trying to stabilize me straight up, huh? Because I haven't touched the keys in a while, and it's just pointing me straight up. So that's what the stabilizer will do. Stabilizer is working. Uh, I think that's going to work against us, frankly. All right, let's hit recover. Let's hit recover vehicle. I w I would love to. Oh How really? Do do that? Yeah, you have to program. You have to program the abort sequence to do something. Apparently, that well, might. You know what? Let's do it'll that. It'll abort itself soon enough. Yeah. <laughs> Indeed. Fire full throttle. See if you can stop I it. I have no gas. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, we're going back to space. Yep. No, not quite. Impressive. Got to four hundred meters. Yeah, that's a good launch. Got some electricity going. Yeah. <laughs> All, All right. right, total loss of view. That's how we like to end uh, our phases. Yeah, no, whatever, what whatever mark version of this this craft. Nope, that didn't do it. Is it shift F three? Nope. How do I get that? Uh, it's just the F three. You have to hold the control. You have to hold the command button to make yeah, sure it does that. Though. It's doing that now. F four, maybe. Ah, there, there we, we go. go. Uh, it was F three. I was hitting F two. Because there's uh, a huge glare that I can't see. Okay. Uh, all right. Advanced inline stabilizer crashed into terrain. Sure it did. Let's go. So let's go to the vehicle sim. I, I I think you should try the reaction wheel. It says maneuver hold. Like I okay, think this is what we. But go want. back to the other thing. The other. So did you notice that? The, okay, go back to the first one. Um. Oh shit. Okay, because the one thing that the the one that you want to put on there, it actually has something about stabilization. Yeah. It says stability assist. Maneuver hold. Per, like a lot of Okay. Shit. Let's do it. Let's throw that on there then. Okay. Let's... And it looks cool too. Yeah. So we need some kind of other we pod need... to well, Yeah. To throw this on, yeah. This one? What the fuck? What do you mean? I thought wait. Strap this on top of it? No. Why would you strap that on top of it? It says it require it can't be automated, right? Oh, is that so so we have to put a kerbal in there? If it contains internal internal control systems. Uh, 
Hmm. I feel like this is going to require a Kerbal Astronaut. It's fine. Well, not exactly. Why? Well, it'll because die. well, no, I don't care about it dying. I'm just saying it's dumb. We're not. Lo- I I don't want to. I mean, plus that's a whole other thing to learn. You know. It's true. How the fuck do I get rid of this ring? You have to grab it. I can't. Hmm. Zoom in so you can get uh, click off of it because right now it's the whole thing selected. Yeah. No. Now it is. Huh. Well, click. Can you click on the other thing? All right. There you go. I don't know if that's the way to do it, but. It'll work. Are you taking out the stabilizer? Yeah. That was the stabilizer. What the hell is that ring that's on there then? Uh, that ring is the the cover <laughs> that was supposed really? to go over the top. Really? All right, we'll get rid of it too. That did nothing. Oh shit! I can't. So all right. All right. Now we need to put something in there to be the base. Cause... What if you put the stay putnik? So that way we have the best of both worlds. I just don't know if this is gonna work. Well, then how There's... am I gonna get the? Is there nothing with no way to attach that? Ah. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Let's do. A lander can. Inline cockpit. I like it. Strap this to the top. Well, you've already... What the fuck? You got a, a cockpit connect to, uh, attached to a command module? Yep, here. There you go. <laughs> Why do you want to like that better than the other arrangement, I guess? I don't know. Let's just do it. All right, sure. See what we got. Save it. Let's go. <laughs> I hope we got a Kerbal in here. Because if not, we do. How do how do we know? Can we see? Yeah, him? he's down there. Do you see him? Oh yeah, he's down there fucking around. Send him on an EVA. <laughs> uh, ready? Wow. Yeah, ready he's ready. Look at him. All right, Kerbal. Uh, I can't stress enough that these are volunteers. Yes, uh, and they know it's a one-way mission. <laughs> well, if they read the fine print, sure. All right, T minus three, two, one. We're off. Okay, now let's try and and gently angle ourselves. See if this thing will actually hold its... That guy is so happy. (laughs) What if you give him max throttle? Does he, like, black out? No, he's he's holding steady. Uh, uh, So we're moving. We're moving. Yep. Uh, Let's see. Boy, I'm uncomfortable with leaving it in a smoking state. Well, it's... yeah, you need to back that throttle down a little bit. Okay, not that much. <laughs> I just, I just want to get it. To it's where not we're a not binary control. All right. Uh, yeah. Now you need to the plot the. Oh, All right. Wait. Whoa. Whoa. Go. Yeah. Look. Oh, Too shit. late. Too late. All right. So let's get next time when this thrust. thing explodes. Oh look, it's his. He's in space now. You can tell. His cockpit got dark. How are we doing? So I feel like I need to maybe. Ed, edge it over a little bit. Oh, shit. What's it doing? Fighting you again? A little bit, yeah, but I think that's resistance from the atmosphere, not... Yeah, we're on... We're... You know... Nope, nope, that's the wrong way. Let's go this way. Yeah. No. Nope. 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 Maybe we should wait till we get to about 60,000 kilometers. Or... Yeah. Uh... Maybe we should wait till we get to about 60,000 meters before we try to do any kind of aerodynamic maneuvering. (laughs) What are you saying? This is not working. (laughs) Well, (laughs) as we spin up, what's the, what's the fuel? What's our fuel looking like? Oh, that's a real good question. Not great. Oh no. Okay. I've seen the uh, mono propellant. The fuck is that? What if you hit a space? Will it eject the command module? No, because we don't have a decoupler. Oh, we don't. I think that would just kill our engine. Uh, here, let's throw up a little. I'm trying to get this thing back under control. It's not working. I wonder what point the Kerbal will get worried. Uh, good question. Yeah, we didn't have this much. We didn't have this much issue when we were just fucking around. Uh, let's fire it. Send it down. Oh boy. We're going to try and do this with bursts of <laughs> thrust. We're going the wrong way, aren't we? Well, kind of. We just need a lot more thrust to get us where we need to go. 
But you don't even know which way you're pointing, honestly. Uh, kind of I do. I'm trying to point toward the screen a little bit in that direction. All right, well, we're out of fuel now, so that's what happens. What's the trajectory now? Terrible. Is that it's where terrible. it's going? I think so. He raised. So we made it nowhere near it. No. Still haven't, we still haven't gotten the control thing figured out. Yeah. I don't know if we're meant to have control. Maybe our wings aren't big enough. Do we need giant ass wings? Well, Maybe so we that can would fly it like a plane. But that's the thing; like that will make a flag, and it makes it fly straight. It doesn't really give you extra control. <laughs> no, I don't but think you want to. But then we won't fly tumble like through plane. the air. I think I we want to fly more like a plane. We're in the atmosphere, right? We shouldn't be like a if jet. We're, we shouldn't be for a ballistic uh, missile path. I feel like we also need a lot more fuel. So what is the white line versus the blue uh, line? This is some satellite thing. I don't know. Oh, is this one that we shot? Yeah, this is one we shot off before. Where? Switch to this. <laughs> this thing's just been going. Wait, but that's not. I don't know. Huh? Is it coming back to Earth? I yeah. thought we put it. I thought we put it in this. No, it's not. It's getting further away. For now, it is. But if you look at the trajectory, it's going to land there no dude it's way far away like that's not the correct trajectory how can that you, not you be right look at the look at the actual how far it's 715 kilometers away from earth yeah but its speed is dropping eventually it's going to come back down right but isn't that further away than the moon is so the apoapsis, the farthest part of the orbit, is going to be 906,000 meters. Which is way far. I'm just saying that the, that actual little arc of the orbit is not accurate. No, the moon's way out here. It is. I mean, this stuff is just not relative. This is not like Earth, right? Like you get that far from Earth and potentially huh. you're... Okay, I see what you're saying. You're gone. My scale is all fucked up. Because I forgot it switches to kilometers once you get f far enough away. Okay, when did we launch that, by the way? Uh, a while ago. Oh, ten, ten and a half minutes ago, according to game time. What? Oh, oh, because it only plays the game time when you're actually rolling. Okay, interesting. Uh, what happened to our Kerbo? We, we might have been burying the lead here. I think he's already... Nope, he's still... Yeah, I mean, I can speed shit up and yeah, let's crash. Do it. Let's or, do it. Or we can just go back. And let him crash on his own. <laughs> no, I, I kind of want to see what happens. Okay. It's the least I can do is talk this guy through his final moments. As I <laughs> speed it up because I'm impatient and bored. Whoa. Uh, Here we go. <laughs> Crashing back down to Earth. Yeah. Kerbal Three owes minutes. you a great debt, sir. <laughs> oh, he's not even going to make it to Earth. He's going to explode no. in the atmosphere. No. The the name of Jebediah Kerman oh, will he's so will, will live forever in our hearts and minds. Oh, and he's inspire, gonna splash down. Inspire future generations of astronauts. He made it. I'll be damned. No. He's alive and well. And he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say if he survives this, we have no way to recover him. I don't even know. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's not on our radar. Okay. Space Center. Poor guy. So, I don't know about this manual control thing. It's finicky as shit. Sure. I'm pretty sure I can't aim it where I want it. Uh, we do I don't understand fuel, why I don't understand why once we put it on a trajectory with those fins, why it doesn't hold. I honestly don't. Yeah, I I don't know either. Uh, I'm going to try and split this thing and give us two two shafts here two Wait, shafts yeah double shaft it oh double tanks yeah why don't you go quad tanks with smaller ones okay i can do that too uh let's put this thing up here although we still need to have the big massive engine my god this thing's gonna be a monster oh my god <laughs> well you know what why don't we need bigger right why don't we just go bigger? Yo, I don't, I'm not. I'm not in love with the cockpit, honestly. Yeah, 
So I'm going to delete this, delete this. The controls are really, oh, this is going to be ridiculous. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Beautiful. Uh, what? That, that thing is not shaped like a sphere, correct? Am I seeing yeah. that? Okay. Weird. It's kind of got flat sides to it. Okay. Um, <laughs> now, now, where are you going with this I thing? think we should, okay, so I think we should put a smaller stage on top like maybe that yellow maybe that orange the orange thing on top like i want to learn how to do stages essentially yeah and then can we strap this sure and then this yep yep and then this oh shit oh shit we're building a rocket oh shit <laughs> let me zoom out a little here get rid of this thing we need a big ass rocket at the bottom of this thing too right yeah so we got the... That's tiny. That's too small. Well, what if you put four of them on, though? This is what we were using before. All right, can you put three of those engines on the bottom of there? Sure can. Jesus Christ, this thing should just leap off the platform. Although I haven't really done any... Wait, what the hell is that thing doing? Might be too small, actually. What is... Oh, it's an uh, engine it's a adapter. It's a tricoupler, yeah. That might be too small as well. I need to. Yeah, there we go. Now let's strap engines to it. These engines might be too big. Yeah. Well, uh, wait. We so why can't we get a bigger coupler? Oh, oh. What do you think about that instead? How much thrust does it put out? Max thrust thirteen hundred. Like. Okay. Almost sure. Three times Just what? Put there on the, Put that on there. Get rid of that coupler. Perfect. Okay. I think we've got a rocket. Now we need some fitting, but we still don't know how to... I'm going to put big-ass so fins on it. Here's what I'm going to suggest. Let's just take this thing straight up in the air and until we're ready to detach, and then we can try... Oh, Jesus. It's a little too big. It's tail fin. I don't want a tail no, fin. No, that's a, that's a spatial tail fin. Delta. All right. It's pretty big, but it's pretty big. Okay. That'll work. And we don't need fins on the top part because now put a cone. Just can we put a cone on top of that? No, we've tried. No, the no, cone let's do, a no. But I think times. we do. Got to go. You got to do a coupler, and then a cone. Let's get the big ass one. That's too big. <laughs> the one right beside it, I think, will be. Oh yeah. Oh. Ooh. What the? Fuck? I don't. Know. <laughs> what the hell? Oh oh, oh. oh. Okay. Here we go. We. Oh. Now I see. Big pointy. Yeah, nice dude. The big pointy. <laughs> This will work, right? <laughs> Where are we making a Bassard a Ram scoop? scoop? <laughs> yep. Collect all that hydrogen. All there right. we go. Look at nice. That. Oh, 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 shit. Yeah. Oh, no. Now you're opening it up like the Stargate. What is going on? Dude, I think we've actually learned some things. <laughs> Nothing useful. <laughs> Here we go. I think this we is so much this. like. I cannot stress enough how much this does not look like an early intercontinental ballistic missile. No. But now no, that you got looks... the, the SAS system, I feel like if this works, we've... But the stability might just try and point me straight up, like the last Well, one. no, because it's not stability. It's actually control. Okay. Stability augmentation system, stability assist system. Uh, yeah. So this is supposed to not... This is... Because the other thing, the other thing that I was thinking of is if I you can angle those wings, right? If you angled those wings, it would get it spinning, which would tend to give it like rifling type stabilization. Does this have oxidizer in it? Oh nope. god damn it! God nope. damn it! It doesn't. So we don't actually have a functioning rocket here. No. Huh. So liquid fuel. So. Liquid fuel tanks alone are designed to be used in oxygenated atmospheres. Oh. So why could But we need an intake then. Yes. Which we don't have. That's what we need to throw on there. Okay, so I think we're fine. Because we only we, we want to use this stage in the atmosphere anyway, right? Yeah. I mean, depending, you want to go way up and then we might not have enough oxygen to do it. But... Well, but I mean we should get this thing fucking moving, I guess is what I'm saying. <laughs> I don't know, let's see. Uh, so where would that be? What is that? Is that a performance? Is that an aerodynamic? Is that a... It looks weird. It looks like a boat laying on its side or something. There you go. 
Well, you got to put it. Yeah, you go. So put three of them on it too, and like mount them between the fins. I think that'd be pretty sick. All right. <laughs> Boom. Air now, intake 2.0. So we get 6.0 of air intake, which I don't know how that translates to either. actual <laughs> intake resource air, intake area. No, let's just try it. Yeah. Let's see. See how this goes. We didn't. We didn't get the adapter. Jesus Christ! Source, so. I have no idea if my stages work. I don't know if the air intake is gonna work. It's thrilling. Well, at least we're not killing Kerbals. Let's, let's drop this down for a second so we can watch this thing not take off. It's a big rocket. I cannot wait to be over this cold completely. All right, that is a big rocket. It's got a nose cone, which really pleases me. Yeah, you are. You are surprisingly pleased by that. Okay, ready? Yep. Here we go. Throttle is that up. it? Throttle up. Yep. Shit. Those intakes. I don't think those intakes are going to work until we get moving. Huh. Wait, oxidizer 3520. Oh, that's in the small tank. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just bu that's bust stage through one, all of them? By the way, here's stage two. Oh, we're going. <laughs> <laughs> going, baby. <laughs> just nose that was it into just the support ground. structure. Just nose it into the ground. Yeah, that's 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 a fancy gantry. I can't. I actually can't with this. Well, at least get it away because I don't want to rebuild our okay. shit again. Here we go. There you go. Set engines to maximum. <laughs> Houston, we fucked up. <laughs> We're going to try and steer it into the ocean, Houston, so as not to kill the civilians and the crowds watching. Less than two miles away from the launch zone. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> so what is this? What the fuck? How do We're we... just going to fly it at ground level all the way, <laughs> all the way to Perth. Yeah. Um, Here yeah, we go. I, I don't. I got the shit. This is all me. <laughs> We're going inland. I really wanted to try and steer this toward the ocean, but it doesn't look as if that's going to happen. So just so you know, between 30 and 40 kilometers is when the air becomes too thin for an air intake to function. Okay. Good to know. We're going up. Up, up, and away. We've burned through half our fuel. We're going to try and point this at the fucking... Slam the gas and thrust us into the ocean. Yep. Here it is. <laughs> yep. Yep. Cut the engines. Now we're going to drop into the ocean. Let's see. This is a test of my ability to control this rocket. So we, you can't use liquid on fuel only tanks on your craft. It doesn't seem like. No. Unless you need you're an auxiliary well, engine. You you, unless you're using stage. jet in, like that's so. The, so these are, I guess, the for jet or nuclear engines. Which, okay. Um. I think I yeah. may have just crashed into the, the launch pad again. <laughs> we'll see. Speed this thing up. Oh, my God. All right, guys. It has become clear to me that we need to secondary burn. <laughs> <laughs> we need a ocean injection burn. There we go. Perfect. Now, we're still headed straight up in the air, but that should be remedied quickly. Oh shit! Yeah, I don't understand why we can't have an oxidizer only tank. I think that's uh, they they ought to. Oh wow! So I guess there are module fuel tanks you can do this all man. Yeah, there's an answer to everything in this damn. I game. made it. I did it. Boom! I landed us in the ocean. Nice. Averting sure catastrophe. I would suggest that you crashed us into the ocean, but you know, well, if you need to keep things optimistic, I directed us into the ocean. <laughs> all uh, right. 
let's go back. So we got to take this fuel. We got to we got to completely rethink this whole thing. Yeah, that and, goes and away. Why we're doing that? Get rid of that 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 thing and put a this? no 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 the, uh, the coupler. Yeah, and and put a put a adapter on it because I just want to clean that appearance. We need to want a mark. Well, you know what? We don't know. We need to start with the tank first. So let's start. Let's go back to the tank drawing board. Okay. Uh, let's go to something. So that's what we were using before. I think if we switch to the fuel, the rocket fuel fuselage, we can put two of these on here. Yeah, agreed. Now, do we need pipes? No. Like taking the fuel from. Not no, I don't think so. As long as there, the in entrance. fact, I'd go three because right now you barely. Well, no, okay, okay, you're right because this is a single stage. You're right, two is fine. Okay, but well, wait, wait, before you do that, I want a coupler on there. You you don't have the separation. Here. Oh, you do have the separator. No, we pulled the separator out. I right. Think. Yeah. Okay. So we need to get a separator, and we also need a coupler so they 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 look nice. Where was that shit? Command and control. We, no. You need a coupler first. Yeah, that's I'm trying to find uh, it. structural, right? Ah, that's okay. a decouple. Look at the stuff above. It's uh, it, there. What one over to the left? Adapter. There we go. Uh, that's too small. I think you need the one bigger. Yeah. Yeah. Now, oh wait, you didn't get the decoupler yet. Yep. That's utility. No, that no, was back in structural. That was structural. Yeah. This Seriously? is on the second page. Oh, uh, what does this look like? Way too that's small. That's way too small. Yeah, Mark Three decoupler xl is that it no nope. too small that'll work that'll work well will it yeah it should sweet yeah now we're looking now we got a fucking proper rocket oh oh um gotta oh shit <laughs> i can't zoom out anymore <laughs> well that's what you do when you build a monster oh, rocket fuck. like that Oh Jesus! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what the fuck? I think I may have fucked this up. All right, so let's decouple and then recouple. There we go. Nice. Okay. Nice. Pointy rocket with an engine. Now we need we need wings with a decoupler. And I, I think we need batteries. I need to restage something because first stage was blow the top off this thing. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. So how do I how do I do that? I don't know. So you got okay. stage zero stage is zero that. Stage zero is going to decouple that's right. us. Then... No, stage zero, we need to have this rocket, right? This engine. That goes in stage zero. The decoupler okay. needs to go in stage one. Yeah. What's that thing in the middle? Oh, okay. And then we don't even want that, do we? What is that? That's, that's firing. Nose cone. That's blast the nose okay, cone Okay, put off. that on the last stage. Why not? Uh, Here. Okay, that's cool. So it'll so decouple decouples and, fire, and then well, fire the engine. It does that in the wrong order. Okay, so decouple, then fire, then fire the engine. Yeah, you don't want to fire the engine first. <laughs> no. I'm pretty sure. And then blow the nose cone. Yep. Once we once we reach Perth, we're going to blow the nose cone. <laughs> now, we need batteries to make sure that we don't run out of power when... Oh, man. Yep. So utility has got to be batteries, yeah? Fuel cell? No, fuel cell. We just need batteries because we should be generating plenty of electricity from the motor. Where? Unless that motor doesn't generate electricity. Can you look at that first, I guess? Uh, the engine? Yeah. Shit. Oh, we know that one generates engine. Yeah, you're right. So we'll have enough power regardless. Okay, so we're going to find a battery? Yeah, there should be battery packs. Here we go. No, that's like for a rover or something, isn't it? Uh, well, no, it'll work. Chargeable battery It'll, it'll all still work. It's pretty small. Let's well, see what okay. we got on I, I'm page. looking for stuff that you can. No, the stuff. There you go. Just strap three of those to the fuselage. Oh, 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 look at this. Yeah, but you can put that right in there. You need to put it up high. Uh, yeah, up probably up in that that part of the stack. All right, let's take the nose cone off again. Okay, so that will stack make sure our, our stability system stays powered. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do Throw you think? Throw some fins on it. We need fins. Save. We do need fins. Four. Mate, let's do four. These delta wings are badass. Put it down. Yeah, put her. Put her down as far as you can. It's pretty far. Although you can't really tell, but that's eh, close enough. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Nothing on this is precise. All right. 
okay. I think that looks like I mean, that's way overkill the... for an intercontinental ballistic missile, but... Yeah, I mean, I aside from the paint job, I think we're good. We're but... learning here. We're learning here. Jesus Christ. Okay, Houston, we are go for launch. We are. Kerbin. We have a pretty rocket. <laughs> you know, I could do with a like a stripe down the side here sure. where, where it matches up with the engine, but what are you going to do? That would delay our launch I should window. should say CASA, Kerbal <laughs> Aeronautic and Space Administration. Staging. Okay, docking we're not going to have. All right, yeah. I'm really interested to see how the staging goes. So we're going to fire straight up. Yep. We're going to stage gonna to it. Get get we're to about decouple. 60 kilometers. And then we're going to try and fire ourselves across the planet. <laughs> yep. Yep. This is not going to work. All right. Uh but it doesn't matter. There's no there are no kerbals to die in this nope. fire, so nope. here we go. Launching in three, two, one. Okay, so are you kidding? Are the me? stages in uh, are the stages in reverse order from what we think? <laughs> they must be. They must be, right? That's stage zero. We just fired stage two. So okay, fucking abort this thing. Yeah. That's weird. Okay. So I mean if our engineers are not great, so yeah, just, wiring, just so. I think I think the middle's fine. Yeah, so reverse. <laughs> uh, I need to make another one. Wait. Okay, nose cone. Wait, you just fucked it up again. And then engine. The no. engine needs to be in zero, and uh... no, that's how it was before. Oh, okay. Yeah, which I thought would work. This is why it's hard for a dyslexic person to. Well, it makes no sense. Zero should be the first stage, right? I would think so. Like that's how I mean. But it's not. All right, let's okay. see what happens now. Wait. Yeah. Okay. So, second, like this stage will fire first, yep. and then these. Yep. Should happen in the right order, unless, unless the stages fire top to bottom. Yeah. Inside the stage, we'll see. Well, we'll find out r relatively Here we go. quickly. Yep. Launching in three. Yes. Oh, it's leaping off the it leaping off the pad. Holy shit! Fire it up. So let's go to like three quarters, three quarters impulse here. Mm -hmm. Don't want to burn up in the atmosphere before nah. we even get going. What's our fuel situation? Can we see that? Totally can. Oh, we're not. I don't know if we're gonna make it to sixty, man. Mm, we are. We are really moving. We are. We're getting faster, so that's that's good. I'm going to back off just a bit. I Cuz we're starting to Oh, was the heat to was the heat little, started uh, starting to build and give us a warning? No, it wasn't, but I don't want it to. Uh-huh. See now, now I got to back off a little cuz why? We're starting to glow. I don't like the glow. Yeah, but it oh. literally will give you a heat gauge if it's about to explode, right? Yeah, we might not have time to to rein it in. We'll see. And that's Eject stage sta one. Yep. But we still have half our fuel. So that tells me that that's the, the fuel other tank, tank needs pipes. That's No, we need pipes going to that. This is stage two now. We've lost that engine or that, that tank. Oh, oh, oh. So we do need pipes. Okay. Gotcha. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and send us on a trajectory that's gonna that's gonna do All right, something that's, here. Let's let's see what our what our trajectory is now. Oh god, we're nowhere what near. The fuck? I mean we're going on a parabolic arc right down to the ocean. Okay, uh, so point the way over. <laughs> All right, now see what's going on. Now see what's up. What it's the? moving us. So it's moving the... Not very far. Well, it's swinging around, then it's spreading out. Not fast enough, though. I feel like we needed that second fuel tank. Oh, shit. Yeah, we probably should have nosed it over. In fact, what's happening? Are you losing control again? Yeah. <laughs> Seriously? Yeah, it's still reaching. I just don't think we're gonna swing far enough left. Go, um, pitch it way far over then. Well, then I lose control. Like if I try to do something crazy like that. I'm just going to lose control. Well, we're out of atmosphere, though, now. Let me give it a little more gas. 
see what's going to happen here. Try, and I still think you need to pitch it a little bit more. You mean you, this this essay? Do we get SAS or we don't, we? <laughs> we don't. We don't. We've got nothing. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. This shit's doing and this And we've again. lost control. Hmm. <laughs> Let me see if I can... Oh, Wait oh, a second. Oh. I'm trying to regain control. I'm trying my damnedest. Ah, shit. Shit. <laughs> I can see Perth. I can see Perth from here. Oh, you know what the problem is? So we need the SAS and works in conjunction with the stabilization systems. Oh, we need a stabilizer too? Yeah. Look, if we can just fire full thrust in that direction, we might get there. But as soon as I as soon as I do that, we're fucked. <laughs> Try and spin around here. We might need reaction control thrusters too. You know what? You can also toggle the Shit. you can also toggle the system on and off with T. You aren't uh, accidentally doing that, are you? No. Now I toggled it on. On? Wait. Was it off before? For it real? might have been off, yeah. Stability assist. Oh, ah, oh here we go. That's what is. Antinormal so we, you weren't even using the system. Yeah. Okay. I'm liking this. I'm liking this. All right, dude. We still have plenty of fuel. Yeah, I'm going to try and do a, a controlled burn here. <laughs> Controlled burn. I got the lingo. I got the lingo. Isn't that what got the ranchers to... in Oregon in trouble? Yeah. <laughs> the controlled burn got out of control. Fire. Fire thrusters. All right. Okay, let me back this off, see where we're headed. I think we're online. Let me just blast it. Yeah? Yeah. Let me point well. us a little more. Ah, shit. I'm trying to point us down, but that's sending me... Here we go. Here we go. A little more to the side here. A little up. Fire those fucking thrusters. Oh, look at this. I need to go right a little more. I don't want to run out of fuel here. Let me back it off. My heart's pounding like I'm actually doing something. <laughs> I don't... Fire! <laughs> Fire! <laughs> Firing us into the this reminds me of like Apollo 13 oh, trying to not skip out of your seconds. This is the, the, the desperation I'm feeling. Go, 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 go. Back it off. Back yeah, it yeah, because it the momentum's gonna gonna fuck with you. Oh man, we're getting close. All right. Okay. So I think I need to point us more that way. But but make sure you save. Like we don't want to burn too much more fuel. Yeah. Because you might need to make some fine tune adjustments. So maybe this. Yeah. Well. That's that's man. That's not a fine tune. That's like fifteen degree difference. I know, but we got to swing it pretty high up there. And you got to go left, don't I'm you? Man, I'm okay, trying. Okay, okay. I'm trying, but no, that's going right, dude. That's going right. Yeah, you're sw you're you need to go the other way. Is this where we're hitting, or is this? No, that you're not. See, the 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 aim is go yeah. you're going wide right, so you need to go back left. About 15 degrees, I'd say. Go left? Yeah. Like that? Yeah. But you actually have to burn to adjust your what where you're going. Oh, I know. We just don't have much fuel left. I get it. Shit, back it off, back it off, back it well, off. Well, you can always turn it around and... You can always turn it around and, and, and deorbit. It's getting close. Well, actually, isn't Perth that other thing? This is Perth, right? Ah, I thought we were trying to hit something else. My oh, fault. oh, okay. So, yeah, you need to go. God damn it. That's you what I was going to go trying. way fucking right. I need to, yeah, basically straight right. You can't fly rocket by committee. <laughs> Stop side seat driving. <laughs> I got this shit. We're burning around the fucking globe here. <laughs> Burn it straight into the fucking ground now. Fuck the, you. Yeah, this is um Oh, oh this look is at me Russell Crowe burning around the globe. <laughs> Back it off. We got one more good thrust left. Can I you think I could do it? No. <laughs> if I can burn it directly that way. Yeah, I mean try it. Why not? Here we go. Fire. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, yep. And that's it. Oh, I fired us, I wow. You shot at us, us around the planet. We're in orbit. You put it in orbit. All right. Fair enough. God damn it. This thing still hasn't come down yet. All right. So let's... Um, but its altitude is dropping, so that's good. Um, I'm going to make a radical suggestion here. Well... Let's get rid of the first stage. Let's go back to the orange I, tank. It was way, way fucking easier to control after I turned on the stability control. Oh, yeah. No shit. <laughs> <laughs> right like i didn't know that we weren't using it the whole time i didn't either so i think i might be able to do this what but i'm saying like why don't we use a single stage okay yeah let's go back to although let's save this rock this is a pretty sweet rocket although i felt like i was getting enough like i wasn't getting enough adjustment when we were close to the ground obviously sure uh but i thought we went high enough with that first that first stage i don't think we need the first stage at all? You just put us into orbit with... Yeah, no, I don't. I really don't. Okay. Uh, can we recover this thing, or are we nah, boned? I think... Well, I mean, there's, it's it's in orbit, so... Well, okay. <laughs> we'll come we get you later. We have two. Two spacecraft. Well, one's orbiting the sun. We have Remember three. That, we that have one three. We shot. You're right. You're right. One is in a long-term ballistic... Although orbit. we might not have saved that, because I didn't see that on the tracking. Mm. Let's see. Is this a tracking station? Yeah. Let's go there. Oh no, we do totally have the payload in for sure. In orbit of the sun. The here. payload. Okay. Okay. Uh, yep. I think this is it. Let's do it. I ICBM is, is ready. Our, it's a fat little beer can of an ICBM, but uh, where's the center of mass? Okay. So the stabilization ring, right is boom, center. right in the middle. I like that. We're following best practices. Center of thrust is also that is way down here, of course. Center of lift. Well, that's lifting body. We don't. That's that's like if you're designing an airplane. Okay. Save launch. Oh boy, oh boy! I'm excited about this one. Mm -hmm. This is a good looking cool. rocket. It is. Okay. It looks like the Sirene Penetrator from Star Control Two. It does. <laughs> if it were red. Yep. Okay. Here we go. Launching in T minus three, two, one. <laughs> what the? <laughs> no, cut, cut. Keep it going. Cut. Let's fire these fucking engines cut. and get into space. Oh, I do want to see if I do want to see if the fuel tanks work. Uh. It, this should tell us real soon. And I like that it's drawing from the top one. Yep. Okay. That worked. Okay. Stability control is doing us no favors because it's not on. <laughs> oh, Christ. We need a nose cone. All right. Let's abort this fucking mission. We can't. Oh, we well, can. We can, but it just, we, we got a program to do nothing. Here we go. This will abort it real quick. Hard abort. <laughs> Come on, keep it on the course there. Yeah, here we go. Oh, you know why? Because stability. Well, but why is this? I would think that it would it would want to fall. I think it's the fins. No, it would probably want yeah, to fall that's the what other. I said. Yeah, this an arrow doesn't fall ass down. Well, this is falling. It's falling, yeah. It's, Into the it's, sea. It's not gonna blow up our shit, so I don't care. Oh. Soft landed. Oh, yeah. All right. Throttle up. <laughs> okay. That's that. Oh, mother. Okay. We need to go back and change our staging. Yep. We need... Just get rid of yeah. staging. Just what hit minus. This? The minus button, right? Uh, Maybe. Nope. Gotta have at least one stage. Okay, so we Let's need to cr create put a another second stage, stage in and throw and, this in there. Yep. And... No, no, because remember it does it. Yep. An backwards. opposite order. God yep. damn it. Okay, I think we're good. Yep. Save relaunch. One more time. 
Yep. This is the run. I can feel it. Mm-hmm. I can feel it. I'm not sure quite how that ship is standing just <laughs> in the middle of nowhere like this, but. We need a gantry. Yeah, we do. We need to start learning gantry systems. Okay. Here we go. Launching in three, two, one. Fire up. Throttle up. Let's keep it at around three quarters throttle. I like that. All I right. I like that number. So right about 10,000 10, meters, we're going to start nosing over towards Perth. 10,000? I thought you wanted 60. No, that's too high. I think okay. 10,000 is where well, we want a little bit less of the list, you know. Where are we going to be at as far as like, I mean, we just got to go away from the water. Uh-huh. Kind of, fuck. Yeah. Oh, shit, we got there fast. All right, start nosing over. Like that direction? I think. Let's see. Let's see. Oh shit! <laughs> oh yeah, god damn it! Turn that shit. It's 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 already fucked. No, here let's got half of our <laughs> throttle down a little bit. I don't think so. Let's see what these do. Prograde. I don't think you can turn them on, dude. Stability assist. Oh, I guess you can. Normal. Is normal gonna try and point us up? I think maybe. Mm, I don't think so. You or is it going in normal to... orbit? No, I think it's going to hold its. It's going to hold its course now. So see if you can get it there. Oh, shit. Yeah, we're fucked. We need to. God damn it. Normal. It's trying to do something. Yeah. I'm not doing this. Totally. Yeah. It. It totally is. Get a little more thrust to do whatever it wants to do here. Uh, what when when you move the arrow keys, what happens? The arrow keys? Yeah, when you move the directional keys. the It fucks shit up. But, I mean, is it actually moving that target? It looks like it's moving that green thing on the... You're like, you're actually setting a direction now that it's going to try to go to. God, until it flips the fuck over. So I'd say I'd go stability, man. I think that's what you want. And we just need to turn it on before it gets all pear-shaped. Yeah, we're done. Crank up the time. <laughs> Crank up the time displacement. That's not Our long... fuel's gone? Yeah. Oh, shit. That was quick. Yep. Well, let's have it crash back down to the earth. All wobbly. Ooh, it's starting <laughs> to rifle now, spin. too. Sweet. Oh, shit. Yeah, those fins are doing the exact opposite of what I expect them to do. Christ. Well, the engine's heavy, I guess. Yeah, that's true. All right, well, let's just uh, reset it. Revert to launch pad. Oh, you're going to go to the assembly? Oh, you want to relaunch? You don't yeah. want to change anything? I don't think so. That went horribly wrong very quickly. All right, first. So I got to turn on stability control before stability I start control. moving. Yep. So that's, that's number T. one. All right. Fire off. Three, two, one. Lift off. Get her moving. All right. Throttle up a little bit here. I don't want to go too, too crazy. Let's see how our... Keep our... An eye on our fuel. I don't know if we have enough fuel, honestly. Once we get to 10,000, we're like halfway through our tanks. All right, I'm going to back off on the... That's fine. A and that's the, I'd start... You go ahead and start nosing over now. And then see what that's doing for <laughs> What in this the thing actual is just, fuck? This thing is just fucking flipping, man. Well, see, I don't, I don't <laughs> think we understand how the stability, the how the stability assist is working. Certainly, we don't. Huh? Certainly, we don't. So, what did we put? What what unit did we put on there? The RCS remote control and remote guidance system is supposed to allow target tracking. So we might not have the right we might not have the right thing on there. Oh fuck. <laughs> nope. It's blasted into the ground. Fuck it. 
All right, turn up the the time warp as well. Oh Jesus! Oh, shit. <laughs> oh God! I I wonder if the stability <laughs> is thrown off by the fuel tanks draining in a weird way. Oh, you're right because the center of gravity is going to change and get further and further behind on the vessel as it it spins the fuel. Yeah. I wouldn't think it'd make that big of a difference, though. I mean, this thing's tail heavy, but all right. Um, so, do we have a go back to the launch pad? So, this has all the capabilities we need. There's only one more advanced. There's only there's only one more advanced system than that, the Mark II drone core. Um, so, do we have this? Do we actually have the stability wheel on it, though? I don't think we do. So all it has is the engine to control it with. So I think we need to add. Or did we? So you want the the wheel? Well. It's mm, too small. Yeah. No, that's not it either. Okay. And we still have batteries. Where are the batteries at? No, I think we lost the batteries along the way. All right, we need to put batteries because I noticed our our. Um, you want to throw them in here? Yep. And while you're at it, why don't you add um, one more fuel stack on top of that, too? Where were the batteries? Here. All right, now throw another in engine, because if you're worried about fuel, might as well fix that now, too. What are we using? Maraca that's, Max that's... X216. That one right there, yeah. yeah. Sweet. Okay. And then we got a couple of them. Yep. Get that ram scoop oh, going. Geez. Get that ram scoop going. There we go. <laughs> it's the Kremlin. <laughs> wow. Uh, where, where the fuck is... Is it on engines? No, it's on fuel tanks. I'll redo the nose cone here in a sec. I assume... That... Oh, my God. It's all fucked up. People don't know, but whenever you say, oh, my God, it's he's throwing us back to desktop somehow. So that needs to be the last one needs to bridge down to the. What the fuck? Maybe that's enough. You think? I don't know. Bridges to the battery. That'll power the battery, but then maybe we got to. No, try try it because this didn't happen before. There you go. All right, then put in shit. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. You know what? Maybe that's good. I'm going to let's let's say that's good enough. Yeah, let's say that's good enough. That's not going to work. I okay. think it will. Let me readjust this here. Mm -hmm. How do you even do that? There we go. Okay, now we're looking good. Christ. I don't think we're in any better shape than we were. Well, we do have a stability system now. Something that the stability system can actually use. Enable it. Stability on. I uh, set it to uh, set it to normal mode. I think is that's what we need to do. All right. I don't know what the fuck. What's wait? Let me let me let me look up between normal and anti-normal. Anti-normal. Uh. Okay. Oof, boy. Uh. This goes in. This leads to a long discussion about the nav ball. Understanding that. the nav ball is critical to successful flight. Do you understand the nav ball, Jim? Not one bit. All right, there we go. <laughs> um. Wow. Okay, well, let's just fire it off. Three, yeah, two, go for one, it. go. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> what? How did this happen again? I don't know. We're gonna hit the flagpole though. <laughs> we actually did. It knocked off a fin. Shit. All right. Okay. That did not work. Let's head back to assembly and restage. Nope. Wow. L listen to this. As the normal directions are or orthogonal to the orbital plane, the normal or anti-normal burning will change the orbital inclination. It's on the sure. nav ball, the normal and anti-normal directions are located on the equator line directly between the prograde and retrograde marks. Okay. 
These I, directions I are usually that. used to match the orbital inclination of another celestial body or craft and incline the Holman transfers, but as a time... But as a typical time maneuver, they're pro preferably executed using maneuver nodes. Okay. I don't think we have those. Here we go. Three, two, one. Blast off. All right. Let's take it nice and easy for a while here. Let's not get over overhyped. Okay. Oh, shit. What? See what's happening here? No. It's draining both fuel tanks. I don't know if that's good or bad. Huh. Yeah, you're right. I have a bad feeling about this. Mm -hmm. What does the blue button do? I don't know. Turns off. Oh, like. interesting. Okay, we cool. we burn from the bottom? Uh, no, because that <laughs> seems like being t a top heavy is the worst thing you can do. Okay, let's burn from the bottom. Yeah, halt the burn from that. Or burn from the top, rather. Yep. I don't know why it's doing that. Is our is our um, stability stability assist turned on? Yeah. But okay, yeah. So start. No, I don't nose it over yet. Shit's gonna get out of hand real quick. All right, start nosing her over now. Is that doing that? Let's okay. Okay, now leave it right there. No, I can't. I ah ah. I'm afraid we're gonna have to learn the intricacies of the nav ball, man. Wait a sec. Where are we headed? Nowhere good. Yeah. Oh. Let's see if we can uh I don't even know what chartreuse color is. Chartreuse? I don't know either. Yeah, it's chartreuse rather. Oh shit. All right. Let's see if I can adjust, adjust our attitude a little bit here. <sighs> Come on. Come on. Flip over. Okay. See, you're not actually controlling the direction the rocket is launch is is going in. You're controlling the. Um, oh, I'm well aware <laughs> that I'm not controlling. You're this moving. Rocket. You're moving the indicator on the nav ball. Yeah. Uh, unfortunately, it's trying to assist me here. I think. Okay. Which is not doing me any favors. So here's what I want to do. Um, as soon as this thing explodes, is before you leave the the pad, I want to I want you to play around at the W A S D keys to see what happens with the the indicator on the nav ball. Because look, it's it's trying to hit the target you've selected. I know. So can you gently move that no target idea. around? No, I'm I'm what? full over on the left key, and it's barely doing anything. Well, the the thing is moving. Yeah, the problem is once I. Once I get between those Q two... Q and E rolls it. What's Q and E do? Yeah, roll it. <laughs> hmm. It's definitely doing what it said it's going to do. It's just how to control that movement. I couldn't tell you. It's a fool's errand. Slam it into the earth. Wow. Kicking the final rocket. Wait, you know what? Your RCS seems seems like it's not actually actually active. What are you talking about? Well, how could that possibly be true? Oh, I'm sorry. All right, all right. My my fault. That's RCS. SAS is active. Yeah. Wait. SAS what what is did on. it just? What what happened when you just turned it off? When it hit T again? T turns it all okay, off. Okay, I gotcha. But the SAS, it, then it flashes to something else, and I wonder what that means. Uh, current throttle, current G-force required. Where's the G-force? Oh, sweet. All right, so estimated burn. Interesting. Uh, 
Um, so would you like to throw up maybe? Nope. I'd like to take a break. Okay. I think that's it for now. Okay. <laughs> We've been thoroughly defeated. Yeah. We'll be back. All right.